The Greytech Advanced Steel 2020.1 Power Pack update has now been released. The main feature of this release is that we can now export the model, assemblies or parts to STEP and IGIS format. So we'll start by exporting the whole model. So we're going to choose the drop down and choose export model. And then we now have the options to do step and IGIS. So we'll choose step format. We'll just rename the file step. We can then choose what we want to include. So everything is included by default. And we're going to, for any folded plate parts, we're going to join those together to make one object. Now that the export has finished, we'll open up just plain AutoCAD and start a new template. And then we'll import that step file. Now that the import is finished, we can view that file. And then if we go to a southwest isometric and a realistic view, we can see that that whole model has been imported. The next function we'll look at is exporting assemblies. So we'll just choose three random assemblies and this time we'll choose the export parts to ASIS. This time we'll choose the format uh, IGIS and we will export the assembly and I'll also move these assemblies to the world coordinate system of the files that are created. So again, now that the export is finished, we'll start a new template in plain AutoCAD and we'll repeat the process and we'll import one of those step files. So you can see that they have been exported with the assembly numbers. And again, if we go to a southwest isometric, you can see that that's been brought into the world coordinate system of that assembly. The final option is to export uh, piece parts to step or I just so we're going to pick this tube in here. So this tube has got some holes in it that would need to be laser profiled. Um, so the machines need a step or an IGIS format for that. So we'll choose export parts to ASIS again. This time we'll choose the single part and we'll just change the number so that it uses the part number single. And again, we'll start a new blank template file in plain AutoCAD you can now see that we've got the part number and when we view that file you can see that we have the tube with the holes cut in ready to be laser profiled. So those are the new functions of the Greytech Advanced Steel 2020.1 Power Pack update.